So I have this long piece of just whatever scrap iron that I think it was from an awning. So I'm just going to cut off a piece, probably about up, and we're gone. Nope. Oh, God. Stand by. <laughs> All right. There we go. This is a piece. I'm just going to cut off the length of it. Probably about that much. And then I'm going to try and make it into uh, a pot hanger. So uh, essentially flatten one side so you can screw it into the side of a whatever, your porch or whatever. And then it'll go up like kind of curve up at an angle and then we'll put like a rat tail scroll on the end of it so then you can hang your pots on it um that's the idea anyway so you can kind of see that just from one heat we're getting our flatter so we're getting it Simmer down. There we go. I have a voice activated uh, air dryer. I'm high tech here. Where else would you rather be on a Friday night than hanging out with Tim the blacksmith? Alright, so we're going to try and drift this hole. At least one of them. It's uh, turned out a little off center, but uh, you know, it doesn't have to be perfect, it just has to be functional and working. A hole's a hole. I guess that's what your mom said. That one looks a lot better. Yeah, I like that. Straighten it back out. So, uh, drifted a couple holes there. And now what I want to do is take this bull peen hammer and just make some divots. And throw it on the ground. What I wanted to do as well. Easy hair dryer. No, 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 no. So I need a hardy tool that would hold it there, but I do not have one. So to deal with throwing it on the ground every two seconds. Oh. Come on. Hey, Pixie, thanks again. I don't know if you're still... Oh, no! No! Are we still alive? Okay, we're still good. I think I'm happy with that. So this is my workshop here. It's just I don't have um, I don't have a chimney or anything right now so I can't be forging in here. And, um, but uh, so let me try and show you what I'm gonna do here. What I'm gonna do on this end is I'll I'll taper that out into a point and then I'll I'll scroll it and then the idea is We'll take and give this a whole a slight bend, so then it'll make a uh, a, a pot holder. 
Not easy moving my, I think it's like a 125 pound anvil. Oh, so I'm tin the blacksmith. Oh, so strong. So we're gonna get it back in the fire, get it heated up, um, and then we'll work on the scroll. Once I figure out where it went, how care this. Guys? Okay. Um, I really gotta find a more secure idea for this, huh? So, as in more secure, as in this is, here's, what, is this one of my, all right, rate my setup. Uh, I have styrofoam, trash can, ammo box, and shotguns. Okay, so. Now we're heated up there. We're gonna start uh, drawing it out. So you can see there, just on one one heat, we got our taper down a little bit, starting to turn square. So. Guys, ah. All right, I got some tape on it now. Okay. Hi, I'm Tim the Blacksmith with no head. That's why you can see what I'm doing. Camera zoom. So that's where we're at now. So far, the tape is working. Thanks again for everyone who's been hanging out after uh, the raid from uh, from Pixie. Uh, hit me up with a follow if you could. If you like what you're seeing, and how could you not? Oh my gosh! in the blacks. Okay, I think I got this drawn out enough. So, the next heat we're going to we're going to focus on uh, just getting that tip to a point and then we'll then we'll scroll it up. So I'm good with that. So with that heat, I got camera zoom. Uh, you can see I got a little point on there. So we got the small little uh, dilly there, and then uh, so then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this and uh, heat it back up and make this a bigger swirl. That's where we're at now. Let's have this vision in my head how it should look, and I'm just uh, I'm not sure I'm there yet. So, it's my first time trying to make one. Okay, I'm liking that. I think I'm happy with that. Okay, so I got it partially hot. So again, we wanna go 
Yeah, we want to go forward, so it's going to hang off that way. So let's let's just see what this gives us. So, I mean, it's at like a right angle. I think I just gotta, I gotta warm up this part because I want it to kind of be a more of a gradual. I mean, it's gonna work just fine. You hook a plant in there or whatever, but it's just not what I was really going for. I need a piece across the step and hammer from the inside of the bend. Gotcha. I think. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, so like this, and then where there's not, there's there. Okay. I see what you're saying. Haha, <laughs> check that out. Dude, that's cool. That's exactly what I wanted, man. Sick. Learned a new thing today. Thanks. So that's that's giving me the nice curve that I like. That's what happens when you uh, get to talking and you forget that you're lower than. So now that's a little crispy. So. So you, that. Is not good. I mean, whatever. It's still there. It'll still hold things. It's just not going to be pretty. Yeah. <sighs> well, I'm glad I could give you a little, uh, teaching moment there. Uh, uh. So, that's where we're at. Um, I mean, so, I guess I can't be too angry. I mean, it's my first time trying this idea, and I haven't done much with, like, doing these long bends like this. Um, I've done, you know, rat tail squirrel, scroll stuff for hooks and stuff, but I've never tried to, to make this slight bend. Um, so I'm okay with it. Um, kind of sucks I charred up the end there, but, but yeah, like Ginger Snap said, maybe I'll just hit it with a grinder or, uh, or a file or something to kind of clean it up a little bit. Actually, I'll throw some, uh... I'll throw some wax on it now. So she's still a little hot. Um, yeah, like I said, I'm 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 okay with it. It's just, you know, you get one of those things, like you have an idea in your head of how you want it to look, and it doesn't look exactly like that. That's where I'm kind of at right now. But then I'm also kind of at the point where, um, where I'm kind of over it. <laughs> uh, so, but like I said, it's my first try at doing this, so I guess I can't be too angry. 
I heated up metal, I bent it into something, I drifted a couple more holes, I got used to that, so I'm fine with that. Then I got, you know, I, I met you guys, so this is great. I learned that new skill on how to, to bend it. Thanks again to, to Pixie for the raid. So I was glad you guys uh, stuck around and hung out with me to, to learn some new things. What to do and what not to do. So, I think that'll be good enough. I guess that's our end product for today. It started out as a, a round piece of metal from an awning. And then I turned it into uh, a squirrely bit uh, to hang a pot off of. Learned a couple things, made a few friends. Uh, hit the follow, appreciate it. Tim the Blacksmith, out. Have a good night, guys.